Honorable Your Excellencies Ambassadors, Honorable Minister, ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests of Jazz 2024. Today, I have the special honor to welcome you to the 35th GES on the title Fast Changing World. What's next? This is an event which happens to be a landmark of the Hellenic American Chamber of Commerce with the strategic support of the USA Trade Chamber and Atlantic Council. Looking back to those 35 years of uh, uh, the jazz legacy, I feel extremely proud. What has been the footprint of uh, this institution? Through the global and very volatile geopolitical condition, the ever-changing political environment of Southeastern Europe, and in a world that becomes all the more unpredictable, Jazz has remained a beacon of consistency. It has been demonstrated as a major institution shaping the economic, financial, and business environment of the country. It operates as the summit platform of a substantial debate amongst political leaders and the Greek business community. On the, on the impartiality and integrity. Uh, we have had an impressive of more than 1,000 high caliber speakers, prime ministers, leaders of uh, major political parties, ambassadors, presidents, and chairpersons of uh, important uh, bank institutions and funds, distinguished uh, businessmen, and think tanks. Each year, Distinguished personalities from all over the world participate uh, in uh, live discussions, analyzing the current uh, economic trends, offering uh, valuable views, uh, and uh, proposing innovative tools uh, and uh, best practices that shape policies and uh, promote sustainable development in our country. Dear friends, Despite the extremely stressful global environment, this year comes and draws a, a very positive end for Greece. Following more than a decade of financial challenges, uh, the country has managed to regain its international solvency and trust and manages to be leading in uh, stability against a very strong uh, winds uh, and through very powerful corporations. Greek economy is expected to have a growth of 2.1% in 2024, according to the IMF. This uh, projection uh, reflects the resilience that we have attained. Inflation is expected to be limited at 2% uh, until the end of 2025, thus showing a very important progress in relation to the higher rates of the previous years. The recent adjustments in energy and uh, food uh, and foodstuff prices contribute to this downtrend, although risks still lack due to international conjunctures and pressure due to the climate change. The unemployment rate is still expected to, to maintain its downward trend at 9.8 percent till the end of 2024, supported by the positive growth of real salaries and the creation of new jobs. In the investment field, uh, the private investment meant are still powerful, enhanced by the improved climate due to the recent upgrading of uh, the country's solvency. The higher interest of foreign investors is gradually increasing, especially in sectors that are being supported by the National Resilience Program and the Resilience and Recovery Fund of the European Union. Things appear to be better. Nevertheless, we cannot ignore all the critical lessons taught lately, especially by the major natural disasters that have affected Greece, as well as the rest of the globe. All these facts underscore the dire need to take immediate action against climate change, attaining the very ambitious goal set by the government will demand not only a quick recovery, but also a long-term planning 
on resilience so as to be protected against future threats related to climate. So as we turn our glance to the future, the question rises, what is to follow? 2024 was an election year for the biggest part of the planet. So uh, at the conjuncture of important changes in both the economic and geopolitical uh, landscape, the developments uh, on climate change are always at the epicenter with the need for sustainable strategies to be adopted uh, uh, urgently. At the same time, technological development still continue transforming our economies, our societies, and our daily lives. In this 35th uh, GES conference, I invite you to acknowledge the decisive role of our contribution in dealing with all these uh, pressing issues of our era. Over the next two years, we will be exploring the ever-evolving global landscape from the rapidly Uh, affected uh, technological transformation to the risks uh, of uh, world uh, recession. Our distinguished speakers will offer very valuable knowledge on critical aspects from innovation and education to the future of work, the transit to green energy and sustainable development. We will demonstrate critical queries. How can Greece uh, uh, strike a balance between inflation and growth? And how do the uh, latest uh, changes in the USA administration will affect Europe and the world? We will grow deeper, go deeper into studying technological disruptions such as AI and automation, and we will be analyzing the impact on employment and skills. Before concluding this uh, brief introduction, I would like to express my warmest thanks to the organizing committee of the Greek Economic Summit and all those who have greatly contributed to shaping this uh, excellent agenda. I would also like to thank the speakers and our sponsors for their support and cooperation. Mainly, however, I would like to thank all of you here attending ready and willing to make a difference through the exchange of knowledge. Thank you.